Hi guys, so I'm going to go over what to expect in a day of a 30 day nutritional program. So having your kit, okay, you should know how to, or at least uh, seen a video on how to make a smoothie, how to do your seven day cleanse, how to do a fizz. So in a day, this is what it should look like. You should have a cup of tea, usually in the morning. I like it nice and hot. You can actually boil your cup of uh, tea, let it sit and put it in a uh, another tumbler with more water and ice and have an iced tea. So that should be one of the first things you do. If you're a morning person like myself and used to be a coffee drinker or one of those like I need a real big punch in my morning, I would make the fizz as one of your first things that you drink in the morning. Now for your breakfast, you can um, do, remember you're still having um, three meals. Two of those are gonna be substituted with one of your shakes. So here we have a chocolate shake, which was made with banana, one banana and a scoop of almond milk with almond butter, um, almond milk and water. Um, there are also other recipes like the vanilla powder with, um, you can put berries, um, spinach. There's many different ones. Check with your consultant to give you uh, a recipe list. Um, and so you also have your seven day cleanse if you're going to be using the seven day um, cleanse. Normally this is used on your second week of your 30 day detox. So a day would be a cup of tea in the morning or an iced tea, um, a meal, energy drink, either your midday crash or your first thing you drink. You can have up to two of these a day. If you really need to, you can do three a day. You've got enough in your fit kit. And then you're gonna have substitute two meals with the smoothie. I personally like to have a real meal with the family, so I drink this for breakfast, this for lunch, and a real meal with my, uh, with my kids. And there is a um, cheat sheet that we do um, recommend with your kit, which check with your consultant to make sure that she gives you the cheat sheet list as well as what a meal should look like. So I hope this has all helped you and enjoy. If there's any questions, check with your consultant.